government says it will continue to provide a conducive environment for youths to utilize their skills in various sectors of the economy and contribute to national development. Minister of Youth and Sports, Emmanuel Mulenga, has also encouraged youths to take advantage of the opportunities provided by the ministry through the Youth Empowerment Program. Uh, speaking when he opened the youth engagement meeting in Lusaka, Mr. Mlenga said more needs to be done to utilize the potential that youths possess. I Meanwhile, well, Youth and Sports Permanent Secretary Joe Kapembwa said government will provide such forums for youths to air their views freely. National Youth Development Council Secretary David Timsonda said youth engagement in national matters is one way they can positively contribute to national development. A National Restoration Party NAEP leader Steve Nguenda has advised youths not to shun the meetings called by government to dialogue over the applied. Mr. Nguenda says young people need to honor invitations to dialogue with government officials as they keep speaking for the voice less in society. Number one, provide a forum to enable the youth to bear their views in a systematic manner and engage government. Number two, to have dialogue with the youth following the recent concerns raised with regard to youth empowerment and employment. Number three, to give the youth a platform to air their views on issues of national development and enable them provide suggestions. Number four, to assure the youth that they have a stake in issues of national development and that they should consistently engage government without fear. Is to provide a platform for you, for you to engage government and express your views concerning youth empowerment and employment. Honorable Mr. Sir, as you are aware, the Ministry holds consultative meetings with the youth on an annual basis. However, this meeting has been called to provide yet another opportunity to hear from the youth that have called on government to provide an ear on some of the pressing issues that the youth have raised through various means of communication, which includes social media, television, and interfaces, personal interactions with government officials, or indeed amongst themselves and the community at large. I'm very positive that the outcome of this very important meeting will inform the cabinet and the head of state by eventually of the representation that we have in our midst. Honorable Minister, I would like to inform you that we endeavor to have a wide representation of youth in this meeting. We managed to have representation from civil society organizations, the church mother bodies, youth organizations, youth who are working with international NGOs and agencies, and independent youth activists. These young people have been drawn from Eastern Province, Central, Copper Belt, and Lusaka Province. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.